Hey everyone, welcome back. I came to Publix to finish my I bought a make it rain bonus. Before I came here, I stopped at Walmart. This is gonna be a combined video, so I will show those deals before I show this one. But I am filming the intro because I didn't film it over there. I came to finish the bonus, like I said. I need four more of 36 to get a $10 bonus. I'm gonna take you through Walmart and then through Publix, show you what coupons I used and the final cost for everything. Um, this is a Checkout 51 offer. This is my favorite creamer ever. I did mention in a past Publix video. That's the only reason I'm picking these up because they're super cheap. So let's go ahead and go through the store and then we'll go over the final numbers at the end. I'm gonna grab five of these Nestel Nestum again at 198. The total for five is gonna bring me to 990. I bought it's gonna give me back $2 for each one for a total of 10, making this a 10 cent money maker. This is a coupons.com app rebate. We have a rebate for $2 back on a Betty Crocker cookies. So I'm gonna grab these for 198, submit it for $2 back, making them free. This is a swag box and I bought a deal. I'm gonna pick up two of these coffees. This is a dark roast at $4.96. That's gonna bring me to $9.92. I'm gonna get back $10 on swag bucks for buying two, and then I'm gonna get back $1.50 for each one on Ibotta, making this a $3.08 money maker. I'm in the Hallmark section. Again, I have two rebates. I have a $3 when you buy two, and I have a $2 when you buy two, and they're attaching to when I just scan two cards. So I'm gonna pick up two for $1.94. These are 97 cent cards, one's right there, and then this one is right here. That's gonna bring me to $1.94. If both of them attach, it'll give me back $5, making these two a $3.06 money maker. We'll just have to check um, whenever I submit my receipt to Ibotta, but of course I will let you guys know. So four of these Mentos priced at $3.12 is gonna bring me to $12.48. I'll get back 1,600 swag bucks or $16, making it a $3.52 money maker. Then Shopkick is offering 35 kicks when you scan it in the store and 325 kicks when you buy it for a total of $1.44 back, making the final cost for four of these a $4.96 money maker. So I saw this deal on Saving with Danielle's uh, channel. I'm gonna pick up one of these for $1.72. I bought it's gonna give me back $2, making it a 28 cent money maker. This biotin is priced at $2.98. I'm gonna buy one with no coupons. I bought it's gonna give me back $2.50, making the final cost only 48 cents. These Dove gift sets are priced at $9.98. I'm gonna use this dollar off of one. I print it from their website. I'll pay $8.98 in the store. Fetch Rewards is offering back 1,500 points or $1.50. I bought us offering back $3 and Shopkick is offering 25 kicks when you scan it. It's attaching to two rebates when you scan both, so it's giving back 50 scan kicks. And when you buy it, it's gonna give you back 600 kicks for a total of $2.60, making the final cost just $1.88. I'm gonna grab these Snuggle Exhilarations again, priced at $3.97. I bought us gonna give me back $2.50, making the final cost $1.47. I'm gonna grab two of these Sir Kensington uh, Classic Mayonnaise. These are priced at $5.49. I don't have any manufacturer coupons, but I do have two of these from the winter savings booklet. That's gonna take off $3, leave me to pay $2.49. And then I bought it's gonna give me back $1.50 for each one for a total of $3, making two of them a 51 cent money maker. This is a repeat deal. I did this on Wednesday when I came to Publix, but the Keebler Chips Deluxe Cookies are buy one, get one free at $3.59. I'm gonna grab one at Half Bogo for $1.79. I'm gonna use this 50 cent off of one because I only have one more coupon. That's gonna leave me to pay $1.29 in the store. I bought it's gonna give me back 75 cents for buying one, making the final cost just 54 cents. The Chobani Creamer is on sale this week for three for $9. I'm gonna pick up three. I'm gonna use three of these dollar off of ones. These come out in the November 6th. Um, I believe it's the Smart Source. I'll put the uh, exact insert here on the screen. That's gonna lead me to pay $6. I'm gonna get back a dollar for each one on Checkout 51, making the final cost only $3 or a dollar each. Today the new extra savings flyer at Publix came out. I'm gonna grab two of these Axe hair care products at $4.99. I'm gonna use one of these $4 off of any two from the flyer. And then I'm gonna use two of these $2 off of one. These do expire today. 
Two of them is going to bring me to $9.98. It's going to take off $8 in coupons, leave me to pay $1.98. Then Ibotta is going to give me back $2 for each one, making the final cost $2 and two cent moneymaker for two of them. I'm going to do this deal again. The Dynatap is priced at $3.29. I have this $2 off of one from the healthy savings booklet. That's going to leave me to pay $1.29. I bought it's going to give me back $2, making this a 71 cent moneymaker. So here's the receipt for everything I picked up at Walmart. This is the Betty Crocker cookie mix at $1.98. I grabbed the wrong one. I grabbed like a 20 ounce bag and the rebate is only for the 17.5 ounce and the 7.5 ounce. So I will be returning that. I'm also going to subtract that from my subtotal um, because I'm going to get my money back. Either way here uh, are the Mentos mints. I grabbed four at $3.12. The Dove Body Wash gift set $9.88 minus the dollar coupon. The Christmas cards, two of them at $0.97. Cents. The Bioteen Mouthwash, $2.98. The Listerine Floss Stick was $1.72. The Snuggle in Wash Scent Boosters were $3.97. The Nestum Honey Cereal, I picked up five for $1.98. And then two of the Classical Coffees at $4.96 each. My subtotal was $53.77. Will be $51.79 when I return the cookie dough. And then with tax was $56.85 minus the $1.98. Um, for the Walmart trip, here is everything. So after I returned the cookie dough, $51.79, I got back $28 on Ibotta for the regular rebates. On Fetch Rewards, I got back 1,623 points or $1.62. On Swag Bucks, I got back 2,600 Swag Bucks or $26. I got the $10 for the coffee and then the $16 for the mints. When I first submitted the receipt, it only picked up the coffee and told me it there was no match for the mints so I resubmit my receipt and then it gave me the um, it needs a little bit more time but by the time I got home after Publix like an hour later I had already had the kicks to my account so it gave them to me pretty quickly even though it didn't pick it up the first two times that I scanned the receipt um, on Shopkick I got back a thousand and ten kicks or four dollars and four cents so a total of $59.66 in rebates take that away from my 51.79 subtotal it makes all the items I picked up at Walmart a $7.87 money maker. So here's the Publix receipt. I picked up one of the Keebler cookies at Half Bogo for $1.80. The Sir Kensington Mayo were buy one get one free at $5.49. The Axe Shampoo was $4.99 each. The Chobani Creamer was three at $3. The Dynatap. This was tagged in store for $3.29. I'm also gonna put a picture right here on the screen and zoom in to the tag and the ounces and it is the right one it should have been 329 so um, I took it back to customer service after I cashed out and they gave me back the complete 629 and they let me keep it for free and I still got the two dollars for my bottle at Publix they have a promise that if it is um, rings up for the wrong price they will give you the first one free and if you bought more than one they will fix the price on all the other ones so i only picked up one i got my six dollars and 29 cents plus tax back here is the receipt for that so that was completely free all of my coupons went uh came off just fine i she did scan an extra dollar um on the Chobani creamer. I only gave her three coupons, but that's the only thing I can think of that was an extra dollar because I only had 10 coupons, but there's 11 on here. So my subtotal was $15.06, $16.69 with tax. I had a $27.75 savings. So on Publix, uh, $15.06, and then I got my $6.29 back for the um, Dynatab. So that makes my subtotal $8.77. On Ibotta, I got back $9.75 for the regular rebates. I scanned my receipt to fetch, and I got back 154 points for the Axe, which is $0.15. Cents. And then Checkout 51, I got back $3 for the Chobani Creamer. So I got back $12.90 in rebates. It makes my transaction at Publix a $4.13 moneymaker. So together, um, my subtotal at Walmart was $51.79. I got back $59.66 in rebates. It made that transaction a $7.87 moneymaker. Publix, my subtotal was $8.77. I got back $12.90. It made that transaction a $4.13 moneymaker. 
Plus, I finished my Ibotta Make It Rain bonus and I got an extra $10. My bonus and my moneymaker transactions makes all 26 items that I picked up at Walmart and at Publix a $22 moneymaker. Let's bring us to the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.